Chernobyl. Chernobyl is a city in Ukraine that is infamous for the nuclear disaster that occurred there on April 26, 1986. The disaster was caused by a combination of factors, including flawed reactor design, operator error, and insufficient safety measures. The explosion and subsequent fire at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant released large amounts of radioactive material into the atmosphere, which spread across Ukraine, Belarus, and other parts of Europe. The disaster was the worst nuclear accident in history, and it had severe environmental and health consequences for those exposed to the radiation. The immediate aftermath of the disaster saw the evacuation of the city of Pripyat, which was located near the power plant. Over the years, many other areas around Chernobyl were also evacuated. And a large exclusion zone was established around the site to prevent people from entering the contaminated area. Today, the Chernobyl exclusion zone remains in place, although some areas have been reopened to tourists in recent years. The site of the power plant itself is now enclosed in a massive containment structure, known as the New Safe Confinement, which was completed in 2019. The structure is designed to prevent further release of radioactive material and to enable the eventual dismantling of the old reactor building. Despite the ongoing challenges associated with the disaster, there have also been some positive developments in the years since Chernobyl. The exclusion zone has become a unique wildlife refuge with many species thriving in the absence of human interference. Additionally, the disaster led to significant improvements in nuclear safety standards around the world, as well as increased awareness of the potential risks associated with nuclear power. The meltdown and explosions ruptured the reactor core and destroyed the reactor building. This was immediately followed by an open-air reactor core fire which lasted until 4 May 1986 during which airborne radioactive contaminants were released and deposited onto other parts of the USSR and Europe. 5, 6, approximately 70% landed in Bielorussia, now Belarus, 16 kilometers, 9.9 .9 miles, away. The fire released about the same amount of radioactive material as the initial explosion. In response to the initial accident, a 10 kilometer, 6.2 miles, radius exclusion zone was created 36 hours after the accident from which approximately 49,000 people were evacuated, primarily from Pripyat. The exclusion zone was later increased to a radius of 30 kilometers, 19 miles, from which an additional approximately 68,000 people were evacuated. Chernobyl's health effects to the general population are uncertain. An excess of 15 childhood thyroid cancer deaths were documented as of 2011. A United Nations committee found that to date fewer than 100 deaths have resulted from the fallout. Determining the total eventual number of exposure-related deaths is uncertain based on the linear no-threshold model, a contested statistical model. 15, 16, model predictions of the eventual total death toll in the coming decades vary. The most widely cited studies by the World Health Organization predict an eventual 9,000 cancer-related fatalities in Ukraine, Belarus and Russia. Here are some details about the Chernobyl disaster. The explosion and subsequent fire at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant released at least 5% of the radioactive material contained within the reactor into the atmosphere, including radioactive isotopes of cesium, iodine, and strontium. The disaster caused widespread environmental damage, including contamination of the soil, water, and air in the surrounding areas. It also had significant health consequences for those exposed to the radiation, including an increased risk of cancer, birth defects, and other illnesses. The disaster had a profound impact on the Soviet Union, which was widely criticized for its handling of the crisis. The government initially tried to downplay the severity of the disaster, and it was not until several days later that authorities began to evacuate the surrounding areas. The cleanup efforts at Chernobyl were a massive undertaking, and thousands of workers were involved in efforts to contain the radiation and prevent further release of radioactive material. Many of these workers were exposed to high levels of radiation and suffered long-term health consequences as a result. The disaster had far-reaching impacts on the nuclear power industry, and it led to significant changes in safety standards and regulations. It also increased public awareness of the potential risks associated with nuclear power, and it remains one of the most significant nuclear accidents in history. Today, the Chernobyl exclusion zone remains a heavily restricted area, with only a limited number of scientists, workers, and tourists allowed to enter. The long-term environmental and health effects of the disaster continue to be studied, and the area remains a subject of ongoing research and debate. The disaster occurred during a routine safety test of Reactor Unit 4 at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant. 
The test was intended to simulate a power outage and test the reactor's ability to produce enough power to keep the cooling pumps running until backup generators could be brought online. The disaster was caused by a combination of factors, including flawed reactor design, operator error, and insufficient safety measures. The design of the reactor made it prone to a dangerous buildup of heat, and the operators made critical errors during the test that led to a sudden power surge and explosion. The explosion and fire at the Chernobyl plant were so powerful that they blew the roof off the reactor building and released large amounts of radioactive material into the atmosphere. The fire burned for several days, and it was finally brought under control with the help of thousands of firefighters and other workers. The disaster had significant political and social implications, both in the Soviet Union and around the world. It exposed the dangers of nuclear power and sparked widespread public concern about the safety of nuclear plants. The long-term consequences of the Chernobyl disaster are still being studied and debated, and the full extent of the environmental and health impacts may never be known. However, it is clear that the disaster had a significant impact on the health and well-being of the people who lived in the surrounding areas, as well as on the wider environment. Today, the Chernobyl Exclusion Zone is a popular tourist destination, with visitors able to tour the abandoned city of Pripyat and other areas around the former power plant. However, the area remains heavily restricted, and visitors are required to follow strict safety protocols to minimize their exposure to radiation. The explosion and fire at the Chernobyl nuclear power plant occurred during the height of the Cold War, which heightened tensions between the Soviet Union and other countries, particularly the United States. The disaster had a significant impact on the environment and wildlife in the surrounding areas. However, in recent years, there has been a resurgence of plant and animal life in the exclusion zone, including the return of species like wolves, bears, and lynx. The cleanup and containment efforts at Chernobyl involved the construction of a massive concrete sarcophagus around the damaged reactor. However, this structure was not intended to be a long-term solution, and it began to deteriorate over time leading to concerns about the potential for further release of radioactive material. To address these concerns, the new Safe Confinement NSC, was constructed over the reactor site. The NSC is a massive steel and concrete structure that is designed to enclose the damaged reactor and prevent further release of radioactive material. The NSC was completed in 2019, and it is expected to remain in place for at least 100 years. The structure is designed to withstand extreme weather conditions and to provide a stable and safe environment for the eventual dismantling of the old reactor building. The disaster at Chernobyl had significant social and cultural impacts as well, and it has been the subject of numerous books, films, and other works of art. It has also led to increased public awareness of the potential risks associated with nuclear power and the importance of safety regulations and standards. The disaster was classified as a Level 7 event on the International Nuclear Event Scale, which is the highest level of classification and is reserved for events with severe environmental and health consequences. The disaster had a significant impact on the local economy and the people who lived in the surrounding areas. Many people were forced to evacuate their homes and abandon their businesses, and the long-term effects of the radiation exposure have had a significant impact on their health and well-being. The disaster had a significant impact on the nuclear power industry, particularly in Europe. Many countries suspended their nuclear power programs in the wake of the disaster, and there was a significant increase in public opposition to nuclear power. The Chernobyl disaster led to significant changes in safety regulations and standards for nuclear power plants around the world. It also led to the development of new technologies and approaches to nuclear safety, such as passive cooling systems and more robust containment structures. The disaster continues to be the subject of ongoing scientific research and study, particularly in the areas of environmental and health impacts. Researchers are still working to better understand the long-term effects of the radiation exposure on humans and the environment, and to develop new technologies and approaches for monitoring and mitigating these effects. The Chernobyl disaster has also had a significant cultural impact, inspiring numerous films, books, and television shows. It has become a symbol of the dangers of nuclear power and a cautionary tale about the importance of safety and responsible management of hazardous materials.